Good morning, everybody. Welcome to another Vincent Vision. Happy holidays here at Universal. Today, we are doing something very fun. We are here at 7 a.m., two hours before Islands of Adventure opens to experience the first Grinch breakfast of the season. Out of all of the holiday offerings here at Universal, the Grinch breakfast is one of the most popular for a couple reasons. One, this is one of the only times you can get a full service breakfast experience in the park. And two, this is one of the only ways that you are guaranteed to meet the Grinch when you are here at Universal during the holidays. The Grinch is pretty darn popular, it's a pretty big deal, as are all the different who's and wonderful characters you can meet. Now, for those of you who have done the Grinch breakfast before, it is a little different this year. Circus McGurkis, where it usually happens, is under renovation, so because of that, it's happening at Confisco Grill behind me. And the way that you have your breakfast experience has changed a little bit as well. In previous years, it was a buffet over at Circus McGurkis, you can get as much food as you'd like. This year, it is limited. Every guest who pays for a Grinch breakfast will be getting one non-alcoholic drink, like coffee or juice, and one entree. But there will also be starters delivered to the table as well. So very curious to see how it goes. I did the Grinch breakfast last year and I really enjoyed it. I thought it was tons of fun. I'm kind of excited for a, a, a less buffet type breakfast experience. Um, I've never been like the best buffet eater. We paid $60, we $58.99 for our Grinch breakfast spot and it is very, very popular. So try to get it as soon as you can. If you have not gotten already, you should probably try and look as you're watching this video. We actually have a 7 a.m. reservation. We are some of the first people into Islands of Adventure at Universal, really. Like, the park opens at 8 a.m. for early park admission. We are coming in before hotel guests. There's a designated entrance for the Grinch breakfast, so we're gonna get our table, get our food, and share our thoughts with you in today's video. Hi there! Uh, what's this little fuzzy thing on here? It's a, a, a microphone. Oh, yeah. interesting. It kind of looks like a bingle ball a little a bit. A bingle, there you go. Very I was like, what's the who word for it? I couldn't come up with a who word in time, but I will take bingle ball. Well, I was wondering where they were going to sit us, how much of the restaurant they were using for the Grinch breakfast, but we're actually up on the second floor at one of my favorite spots to eat, right up here on the balcony, which gives you a really, really great view of Islands of Adventure. For the two of us, it's a pretty sweet deal. Got a good spot, got a good menu. Excited to see how this Grinch breakfast goes. But until the Who's and the Grinch show up, I'm just pretty darn happy with this view here. There's a QR code as well. I think if you prefer to just see the menu on your phone right over here. All right, so what was this here, Ellison? It is called the Grinch Punch. It is a pineapple and green apple juice. Oh, that's really good. That's really good. Yeah, pineapple and apple. Very sweet, but it is really good. And since we're doing this at uh, 7 a.m., I just had to get myself a coffee. Our server, Laura, dropped off some uh, treats for the table as well. We got some blueberry muffins, some croissants, and a bowl of fresh fruit. These little pastries that were brought out to us are all super warm. They're nice and warm. Take one for yourself, please. Oh, I see what you mean. Yeah. That's a pretty fluffy blueberry muffin. <laughs> that is for me. Thank you. Okay. Have an enjoy. Thank you so much. Thank you. And then I got the green eggs and ham. I think yeah. that's it. Okay. Oh man. Thank you so much. Yeah. All right, thank you. So our food has arrived. Ellison got the Mayor Augustus Who's biscuits and gravy, and I got the Grinch's green eggs and ham. And I would say I like mine's for the most part. I really like the green eggs. They're soft, not super dry. The ham is nice as well. There's roasted potatoes with them, um, but they are like super seasoned, tons of peppers, and, and uh, gosh, I don't even know what else is cut into them. I like more just like, Plain potatoes, traditional potatoes. Yeah, that's a good, that's a good way of saying like plain. <laughs> um, but Ellison really likes her dish. Vincent said these. He likes his potatoes traditional. I like this. I like the little bit of the kick that it gets. I'm assuming either baked or broiled. But really, it's those peppers that give it that seasoning that I really do enjoy. Ladies and gentlemen, the Grinch has entered the building.
question. Do we like Ooh. regular bingo balls Ooh. or sparkly bingo balls? Yes, sparkly all the way. Absolutely. Sparkly all the way? Okay. Okay. And now, do we just like the red or do we think multiple colors? So as we're leaving, we got a little treat here. We got some Grinch cookies and Max Bone. This looks like some chocolate hearts. It looks pretty darn tasty. We are definitely taking these guys home. Yeah. Come on. Come on. All right, all right. Come on. While we're talking, yeah, let's, like, let's talk about yeah. the help we all need. <laughs> oh. like, like, I'm not perfect. I'll be perfect. That's OK. I, oh gosh, and I feel so vulnerable saying this. I once tried to steal Christmas. <gasps> Hey, no judgment! Safe space! Safe space! You're right, you're right. It's fine. And I'm a better, I'm a better what now? And, uh, I haven't done it! I've been clean for a while. And, uh, I feel good. I feel good. I got that off my chest. What you got? Confession that, time. That was really, really, that was really I hard. don't need your affirmation. You're right, you're right, you're I right. I need your sins. What you um, got? What you okay, got? What's the uh, worst, uh, worst, worst, worst thing you've uh, ever done? At Christmas time. <laughs> um... So I have, oh, I oh, have. He's laying out a story. I'm on, getting the picture. On various occasions, oh, we're long time ago, I have gotten gifts, and I have just said, "Oh, oh, 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 oh My friend, this is what you call putting in a closet and never doing anything with it again. Yeah. Done. This is called, and I'm getting the scientific term. Present face. Present face. Do you have a present face? Yeah, it's like a, it's like a... Let's test like, the theory, shall we? Yeah, okay, yes, yeah, so let's do it. Let's test this thing out. This is all like a scenario. This isn't, you know, yeah. this is like a hypothetical here. I got you this gift! Oh, oh my god. Well, I'm, I'm not gonna actually it's get it. It's a fraud. Yeah, it doesn't have anything in it. Yeah, right. Yeah. And, and then you open it. And sure enough, nothing is in it. What you got? Oh, hey. Thank you, Grinch. Hey, this is awesome. Seriously, thank you so much. Wow, dude. That's all. Uh, thank you, man. Seriously. Thank you. So I'm going to take that back. We're going to workshop that a little bit. Yeah. All right. So, as Christmas has continued for me, I've learned it's not about the gifts, right? That empty box is an opportunity to share in. Oh, I can't believe I'm saying this. Friendship and holiday. Oh. <laughs> Actually, I'm just gonna. I'm trying to eat. You, you got it. Merry Terry. See? Yeah. Uh, I, uh, I feel yes. good. Yeah, that is Man. awesome. Yeah, thank you so much. That's great. Wow. Did you learn a lesson here? I have learned quite the lesson. That'll be four hundred dollars. <laughs> Payment plan? Uh, you know what? I'm sorry. <laughs> With the insurance, we don't know. Oh, sure, sure. It's fine. Well, no, it's alright. It's on the house. Okay. This you will appreciate. I'm yeah. ready. I'm ready. My dog's hair grow. In between his paws, his hair will stick up, and we no. always tell him yeah. he has little Grinchy paws. Oh, he looks just like me. I know. Where do you get your nails done, man? They look fantastic. Oh. 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 No, not yours, man. The dogs. Oh, no. Dude, you, I mean, yours are fine, I guess. I'd, not my taste. Okay. What color would you say that is? Charcoal. That, that's a color. Charcoal. That's, that's like a color. Coal, yeah. Like coal. <laughs> Naughty, naughty! <laughs> well, very nice. I uh, tell, what's his name, Fig? You can call him Fig Newton. Cool. Oh. Call Figgy. Oh, Figgy! Exactly 30 yeah, seconds to tell me your yeah. worst Christmas crime. Sometimes I re gift gifts. Whoa! Re gifter! And I thought I was <laughs> no. cool. That was good. Like, what's the, what's the quality of gift we re gift? Is there a monetary value? You like anything under like 20? 50? What are we talking about? I'm gonna say under 20. All right, yeah, because she's cheapskate. <laughs> cool. All right, so we're re-gifting. Do we re-wrap? Yes, yeah. I mean, she's like, I have thing. some standards. Don't judge yeah. me. Okay, very cool, very cool. Are you still doing this? No, I haven't done it in a while, but I, I will but own you know, up to it. I well, will you know Christmas, it. it's kind of an annual thing. Yeah, yeah, it's yeah. going to come back around. So, like, this year? See, I only shop for him, so that's... I, I, I'm I can't not re aware that I've been re yet. If yeah, I were yeah. to give you an onion... I, this is happening. I don't have an onion. I'm just saying. If I would, and frankly, please don't give onions. If I were to give an onion, it goes bad. It's not even like in its ripeness. It's just it doesn't work. Would you re-gift it to him? He's shaking his head right now. He's giving you yeah, a very clear like, sign, do it. and you're do saying it. maybe. <laughs> My love language is not listening to my partner. Great. <laughs> oh, no. Love that. Awesome. No, it yeah. sounds awesome. 
You guys are really sharp. I like this here. Uh, that being said, uh, I am tired. I'm about yeah. to crash on the floor now. Anything else I can do for you? I think that's it. We're Get right out! Right. Okay. My friend. Bye, Grinch. We'll see you later. Bye, uh, see many, you uh, guys. What are they calling these Grinch days? Grinch. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Love it! See you, dudes. Bye. Bye. See you. Thank you, guys. Thank you all. Oh. Yeah. I loved that interaction with the Grinch. Uh, we had probably five to ten minutes just talking to the Grinch about the holidays. I loved, 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 loved. 1,000% worth it between the interaction with the Grinch and the interactions with the Who's. Such a phenomenal experience. The Grinch experience that we had made all of this worth it. The food I thought was good. I ordered the green eggs and ham thinking that I would like it. I guess I'm not really a green eggs and ham person. I enjoyed the eggs, but I didn't really care for like the ham and the potatoes. The biscuits that Ellison ordered were very tasty. I think the, the amount of food that you get, even though it's not a buffet style, I think still works. The Who's were super fun. They came to our table. The Grinch was fun to meet as well. Seriously, the Grinch was like the best. We were like about like 10 minutes talking with the Grinch and he was super interactive, super fun. You know, you gotta kinda meet him halfway though. You know, especially with a character like the Grinch. You gotta interact with them if you can of course you don't have to if you don't want to you can just go in there and take a picture but since we found that interacting with him gave us a much better experience we had so much more fun we were able to sort of bounce off each other i guess and we got a really great personal one-on-one -on -one experience with the grinch and to me that makes this experience worth the money that one-on-one -on -one with the grinch was totally worth it the grinch is meeting people in seuss landing you've got to wait at least two hours, three hours even, to meet the Grinch this holiday season without the Grinch breakfast or the holiday tour, which there'll be a video of a little later. Overall, would I recommend the Grinch breakfast as part of your holiday trip here to Universal or something you're looking to do? I would, I would. I love breakfast, thought the food is great, the characters are great, we love the Grinch. Best part of this, the Grinch himself called us sharp. So, we love that. To us, that was worth $60. Just a compliment. <laughs> yeah, just a compliment from the Grinch. <laughs> that is all we've got for this video. We hope this helped you determine whether or not you will be doing the Grinch breakfast for you and your family for who? Like who? No, that doesn't work. You're much better at that. Thank you guys for watching another Vincent Vision. Uh, please, if you haven't already, be sure to like and subscribe for more Universal videos like this. Will you be doing the Grinch breakfast this year? Please let us know down below in the comments. I have a funny phrase. You could have changed that to who? Be doing the Grinch Christmas breakfast? Maybe you. Oh my gosh, she's too good with these things. Thank you guys for watching. Bye bye. Wow.